Hello everybody and welcome to this video. In this video I'm going to show you how you can go ahead and post a job to Fiverr. So first things first, go ahead and log into your dashboard. Once you're logged in, you come up here to the right hand side and click your profile icon. Under your profile icon you can see the line post a project brief. Go ahead and click that. That will bring up the brief generator here. As you can see, they're going to use AI here where it says generate a brief with AI and get a curated short list of offers. How would you briefly describe your project? So for this, I've actually already prepared a brief. And uh, what I'm looking for in this particular instance is a video game editor, someone who's very good with editing video game content. I have a top five or top ten uh, channel uh, that focuses on the video game niche and I need someone to help me bring that back to life so in my case when it comes to posting a job I'm looking for someone with a lot of experience uh, I've outlined what the gig is so you'll source eye-catching material from the web under a Creative Commons attribution um, I've given a rough overview of how long the videos will be anywhere between seven to eight minutes with occasional projects going up to 20 minutes in length and uh, I'm looking for someone with high energy edits I've given an outline of what I need in terms of turnaround time. So I've got one video per week and we've got room there to ramp up to two to three potentially. I go into a little bit of detail with pay. So I've said obviously that it's flexible uh, on a per minute or per project basis. I'm happy to look at either. It's very good if you can sort of define that when you're posting your project to go into what you're expecting to pay on the pay scale, uh, just so people who apply can uh, get an idea of what to expect. Um, I've given an overview of what I'm looking for, so I want someone with top tier editing skills, a sharp mind uh, for sourcing relevant and high quality visuals, uh, and creative uh, initiative ideas. Um, someone who's ideally a bit of a gamer themselves and uh, really just sort of already has a rough handle on the niche as a whole. So once you've done this and you've written out a rough overview of what your brief is, you can go ahead then and click generate brief. It's then going to take that content and try and build a rough idea uh, of what you're looking for and who might be potentially suitable. So it basically develops an overview here um, and we've got several fields that we need to come into here. So it gives an overview of the project goal, the video style and tone, script and storyboard and additional information. Uh, now what we need to actually do is go give it a mandatory timeline uh, and a budget. So I'm going to go ahead and put in a budget of £80 and press save. That's just a rough £80 estimated budget here. Obviously, I've got an ongoing requirement for my particular brief. Um, but for this particular video, I'm going to put in £80. Uh, the timeline. Um, so when do you want this project done by? You obviously need to select the one that suits you. I have an ongoing need. So I'm going to actually just press I have an ongoing need as this is something I'm hoping will be a continuous project and I'm going to go ahead and press save there so and then I'm going to go ahead and press source for me or invite freelancers invite freelancers will send out some invites and also allow people to apply but it will allow you to actually directly approach editors in my case for your brief I'm quite happy with Fiverr just putting out the brief and seeing who's interested so I'm going to press source for me and then it goes your brief is being created and now it's going out to source freelancers for my brief. Once that's done, we can then go ahead and press view brief progress or see all briefs. This is good to just get an overview of all of the briefs that you've got. But I'm actually just going to go ahead and click view brief progress as I want to see where it's at in the timeline. So we go back to our dashboard here now and we can see that we have uh, a tab here that says waiting for freelancers to send you tailored offers few hours I expect I'm going to have a couple of applications in here so I've now successfully posted this project to Fiverr but that's it for this video guys I hope this has helped you post a job on Fiverr